frequently remembered and recklessly reconstructed lyrics uh, to a song by an early 70s glam band called Trash that I heard in my dream the other morning. They don't exist. This, this doesn't exist. Wake up, babe, I want to take you down. I want to groove with you. I want to introduce you to the sound. We can ball all night. We can get it right, or we can tumble to the ground. We can take it if we make it right. We can take the trouble. We can take the underground. I can be your daddy. You can be my queen. We can be real pretty. We can be 19. We can be somebody. We can take this dirty town. We can take it standing. We won't take it lying down. We can take the high road. It won't lead back around. We can take them all out if we take the underground. We can take... Uh, what was that say? <laughs> we can take the something. We can take the heat. We can take it to the motherfucking street. <laughs> we can take the airwaves. We can take the Mad Queen's crown. We can take the huntsman. We can even take his hounds. We can take it in our bodies till we drown. We can take it, baby, if we take the underground. This is the last flarf poem I wrote. Maybe the last, last one I'll ever write. It's called Purple Money Skunks. It's for Maurice Berber. German sauna, 1779. Rubber stamp archive. Nicole Kidman yoga understanding. Scary Halloween parties for teenagers. Face-sitting angry dragon porn. Little Rock urine test results. Sweet 16 tribal piercings. Charlotte church picks. Teenage naturism password hack. X-rated Juneteenth celebration. My wife, sister is hot. Birthday nose hair. Automatic transmission fluid, looking for action. <laughs> High speed Spokane enema photo. Colorado Craigslist big nude animal. Monster fruit. Watermelon bikini milf. 9 <laughs> 11 Antichrist Hilton thong bailout. Virgin Mary Volvo dealership. Printable blank purple money. Meaningful Facebook birthday. <laughs> Video of Beyonce falling down. I'm really, really bored. <laughs> Let's learn about skunks. Skunk profile. When threatened, the striped skunk will face the intruder, raise its tail straight, evert its anal nipples, and spray scent 10 to 15 feet. If the victim doesn't retreat, skunks use the last resort. They raise the tail straight, evert their anal nipples, and spray two streams of yellow liquid 10 to 15 feet. This usually causes the intruder to retreat. But if it remains, the skunk will twist its back around, raise its tail straight up, evert its anal nipples, and spray scent 10 to 15 feet. Skunks are legendary. <laughs> but alas, Alex may harm your computer. Alex Baldwin coloring pages. Alex Trebek beaver dance. Alex Trebek sucks. See ya spring semester. Here's a poem I was going to read, but it's not that good, so I'm just going to read the title in the first two lines. <laughs> Collapsing Planetariums. That's what rich kids worry about. Collapsing planetariums. <laughs> Uh, 
here's a poem I was going to read, but it's not that good, so I'm just going to read the title. <laughs> Et in Arcade Fire Ego. <laughs> Sonata. Militant toy voices sound their flutes or are disputed and thought weirdly of, impossible to tune in that station without first giving up the political part of yourself. We signals disconnect at intervals, replaced by dissonant clangs, but a serious tremor hangs over things, unlike the murmur of summer locusts in some ways. Robotic beeps explore soft knitted tunnels, and I must be interrogated or else the improbable metal judge will decide on his own whether to get with it or to emerge made out of caterpillars or in my image, and in either case remain in his little den of electrical lions as ringmaster or as concierge. Contact. That's some slap-happy bandwidth. Dude's practicing to be Dracula or something. The mad hologram is loose in the arboretum again. Call Dr. Spina Bifida and make him search for it. Rip up a luxury liner if you have to. It would totally blow if this solemn assertion of horrible productivity had gone boat shopping. You know how it is. About a hundred Bugattis show up on your front porch. Tract housing is never this seismic. It's right up there with Krakatoa in the great big swallow me hole department. And down in the Pulse Meadows, they're training a bronze Goliath. I'm bringing a shipyard with me because it's heavy and massive and flattens a bunch of monster trucks. And what's left is an explosion in deep space and 40 trillion magnetic craters. They're shoving this giant tarantula movie from Quonset Hut to Quonset Hut, but Polaroid villages keep dissolving along with what must be palm trees and pieces of Los Alamos. You can't bounce exponents like this and not make the armature afraid. Pointless to tally up the damages when you're just a charcoal plane or just a mistake or a signal. Uh, the next few I'm going to read are uh, from my Sonograms project. These are just Shakespeare's sonnets with the letters mixed up to form new sonnets. And then leftover title, sonnet letters make a title. From Sonnet 58, that God forbid that made me first your slave. The totality for Kid Rock, bloody, 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 so totally bloody. <laughs> if Leonard Nimoy cruises me, I'm young. <laughs> if Tiger Woods abuses me, I'm white. If Maury Povich cheats on Connie Chung, I'm free to be on Connie Chung tonight. <laughs> if revolution bugs you, you're a rat. If poetry arouses you, you're French. <laughs> if someone in a blooper reel is fat, you bet their ass is gonna crush a bench. <laughs> if August Grief or Crawler Glut were free, or Chester Arthur truly had a tail, it were a sad, dull vanity to me, who am the tallest lady of the jail. <laughs> who trust true love, regret a butt tattoo. Who beat up yuppie mucus such as you. <laughs> From Sonnet 67, uh, Wherefore with infection should he live? The title of this one is Bard. In heaven, only donuts are for sale. That's all they ever have up there to eat. If spinach is your snack of choice, or kale, then go to hell to have your leafy treat. In Rome, vanilla sundaes get you laid, while broccoli and quinoa get you shot. So when in Rome, I tell thee, be afraid. If only healthy foods be what you brought. <laughs> In Iowa, we dine on devil's pie. It's made of fish eggs, glue, and bitter paste. New Mexico is where we go to die when devil's pie with arsenic is laced. 
We hid five buds in Cindy Sherman's wig. Which buds, thus hidden, punk it up too big? <laughs> From Psalm 70, that thou art blamed shall not be thy defect. To TV us, out wuss us. Survivor, Howdy Doody, Game of Thrones, the OC, RuPaul's Drag Race, Grape the Bunny, Saved by a Bell, Touched by an Angel, Bones, Lost, Duck the Bounty Hunter, Ben Stein's Money, The Daily Show, The Muppet Show, Twin Peaks, Beretta, Rhoda, Family Affair, ER, The A-Team, F Troop, Freaks and Geeks, Felicity, The Fresh Prince of Bel Air, House, Eha, Heroes, Mr. Ed, The Wire, Osit, Suits, Cheaters, Drop Dead Diva, MASH, Stargate Atlantis, Punked, Spencer for Hire, Into the West, Inside Out, Veep, V, Smash, Roseanne, Fat Cops, The Honeymooners, Dow, Alice, Eve, Here Comes Honey Boo Boo, Dada, Dallas. <laughs> From Sonnet 64, when I have seen by time's fell hand defaced, Cancun, doves of the anal stage, succeed. <laughs> Ted Berrigan was pricking on the plane, his enemies behind him in a row. Synecdoche condensed him to a brain that wrote the sonnets with its little toe. He covered Arizona in a sheet, unvirtuously vague, naively formal. The masses called him Mr. Mystery Meat, although the meat he trafficked in was normal. <laughs> he, he drove his dad's Dodge Aries off a cliff when William Henry Harrison was shot, and ah, how suave, and oh, 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 how stiff, thereafter was the teenage astronaut. <laughs> Go, uh-oh, tweet-tweet, toot-toot, cha-cha, boo. Get 20 nuns wet, then get us wet, too. <laughs> From Sonnet 68, thus is his cheek the map of days outworn. H. Only <laughs> well, we had one letter left. <laughs> My root beer float brings weirdos to the yard. <laughs> <laughs> Who nosh on fresh wasabi by the pound. This nasty house of porn will soon be charred. I'll burn it like I'm left eye to the ground. <laughs> the he as she equations seem abnormal. I saw them in a show on Daniel Boone. They're super hard to solve and ultra formal, and twice as weird as David Lynch's doom. I carved a wooden statue of a rat. It won a statue contest. Darn it, good. <laughs> Imagine me rewarded thus for that. A rodent statue, fashioned out of wood. <laughs> oh, baby warbles on a bushy knee. Free hen's eggs, free fresh hen's eggs, free, free, free. <laughs> From uh, Sonnet 69. Those parts of me, uh, those parts of thee that the world's eye doth view. On the 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 a ten-toed sloth is out of fucking sight. My country house is on a fucking heath. We're watching Thor on pay-per-view tonight and opening the bottles with our teeth. The chronic comes from Idaho and Delft to demonstrate that other weed is trash. Oh, you get high? I'm getting bloody elfed when Santa shares his funky Christmas stash. <laughs> The haters hate, that's how they do not do. We roll, they hate, that's Anthro 102. <laughs> uh, 
last one from Sonnet 65. Since brass nor stone nor earth nor boundless sea, the title is Where She Gets the Bassmaster, I Get Only NSFW Shrews Egg Ensemble BS. Shh. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, you fresh, fresh Western Mormon bears who cause the timid baroness to faint. A bigamous refrain your anthem wears, an eyeball on a stock your truest saint. Hello, you Gothic hot rod Methodists who go to bed in rural Minnesota, but rise in Oklahoma waving fists at San Francisco legend Carol Doda. Hello, you Jewish liberals on acid. who fornicate with octopi or storks, who think these pimp-tight sonnets sort of flaccid, and call the guys that live on Skylab dorks. Hello, farewell, it matters not to me, an Arab Libra bitch with ESP. <laughs> <laughs>